a paradise hidden above the clouds, filled with mysteries, Machu Picchu. Today we will explore this ancient Inca city hidden deep in the Andes Mountains. Known as the Lost City of the Inca Empire, this magnificent structure continues to enchant us with both its historical and mysterious aspects. Here stands Machu Picchu, acknowledged as both a UNESCO World Heritage Site and one of the new Seven Wonders of the World. Machu Picchu is located in the country of Peru in South America. It sits atop a mountain peak in the Cusco region of the Andes Mountains, overlooking the Urubamba Valley. Machu Picchu was constructed around the mid-15th century, approximately in 1450, during the reign of Inca Emperor Pachacuti. Pachacuti was a key figure in the expansion and organization of the Inca Empire. Archaeological studies indicate that Machu Picchu was built in the mid-15th century and abandoned by the early 16th century following the Spanish conquest of South America. The fact that the Spanish never found Machu Picchu led to its lost status for centuries, only to be rediscovered in the early 20th century. In 1911, Hiram Bingham, a historian and explorer from Yale University, embarked on a journey into the Andes Mountains to trace the footsteps of the ancient Incas. Bingham was searching for the remnants of Vilcabamba, one of the last strongholds of the Inca Empire. However, this journey would lead him to an unexpected discovery. With the help of local guides, Bingham stumbled upon a place forgotten by time deep in the Urubamba Valley. Hidden amidst the clouds, atop a mountain peak, lay an abandoned city, Machu Picchu. So, what led Bingham to this hidden paradise? The stone walls, terraces and temples of this ancient city had remained virtually untouched for centuries. Bingham believed this place to be the legendary lost city of the Inca Empire. However, further research was needed to understand the true purpose and history of Machu Picchu. Bingham's discovery sparked great interest worldwide, and the secrets of Machu Picchu began to be gradually unveiled. However, how and why this ancient city was built remains a topic still not fully understood. While Bingham claimed to have discovered Machu Picchu, the city had actually been known to the local inhabitants for centuries. This discovery showcased to the Western world the immense skill and aesthetic of the Inca civilization. Rising high above the clouds atop the lofty Andes Mountains, Machu Picchu represents the pinnacle of Inca engineering and architecture. This structure, one of the greatest mysteries of the Inca Empire, was built in harmony with the natural environment and sensitive to astronomical events. So, how were these ancient structures constructed and for what purposes were they used? Machu Picchu consists of approximately 200 structures, including temples, palaces, ceremonial areas, and residences. Each one is crafted from meticulously cut stones, showcasing great craftsmanship. The Incas fitted the stones together so perfectly that not even a knife blade could be inserted between them. This technique, known as dry stone construction, is achieved without the use of adhesives or mortar. The Incas also demonstrated exceptional skill in water management. In Machu Picchu, they constructed a complex drainage system for collecting and distributing rainwater. This system ensured the habitability of the city both during the rainy season and in times of drought. One of the most remarkable features of Machu Picchu is its alignment with the movements of the sun and other celestial bodies. A stone known as the Intihuatana functions as a sundial or calendar, tethering the sun on the most sacred day, the winter solstice. This serves as evidence of the Inca's ability to track time and seasons. Machu Picchu not only captivates the world with its breathtaking scenery, but also with its unresolved mysteries. Various theories have been proposed regarding the true purpose of Machu Picchu. Some researchers suggest it was a religious temple, while others argue it served as a royal retreat 
or an astronomical observatory. However, in the absence of Inca records, none of these theories have been definitively proven. Certain structures and markings at Machu Picchu further add to its enigma. For instance, the Intihuatana stone may have been used to determine significant celestial events, but its exact function remains elusive. Additionally, the rock carvings and arrangements outside the city raise questions about whether they were created for religious ceremonies or to observe celestial movements. Machu Picchu is closely intertwined with Inca mythology and legends. In Inca culture, mountains, known as Apus, are considered sacred, and Machu Picchu is situated among these sacred mountains, at a point where the sky meets the earth. This indicates that the city was not just a physical settlement, but also a religious and spiritual center. Some alternative historians propose that Machu Picchu was built by a much older civilization and that the Incas merely repurposed these structures. These theories often attempt to explain the complexity of Inca engineering and the perfection of the structures, but contradict widely accepted timelines. One of the most intriguing theories deepening the mysteries of Machu Picchu suggests that the ancient city might have been constructed as a map of the stars in the sky. Astronomers and archaeologists have noted that the layout of Machu Picchu aligns remarkably well with some significant star clusters in the southern hemisphere. Particularly, the Pleiades, also known as the Seven Sisters, star cluster holds great importance in Inca culture and it is believed that some structures at Machu Picchu might have been aligned with this star cluster. Inca legends tell of creation and civilizations coming from the stars. The Incas carefully observed celestial events and organized their agriculture, religious ceremonies, and calendars based on these events. It is thought that Machu Picchu's deep connection with the sky reflects this fundamental belief of Inca culture. Archaeoastronomical studies supporting this theory have revealed that certain parts of Machu Picchu are aligned specifically with significant celestial events such as winter and summer solstices and equinoxes. The most striking archaeological finds at Machu Picchu are its complex structures. Among these are religiously significant buildings such as the Temple of the Sun, the Temple of Three Windows and the Temple of the Condor. These temples are reflections of Inca architecture and religious beliefs. The extensive agricultural terraces surrounding Machu Picchu showcase the advanced farming techniques of the Incas and their ability to live in harmony with nature. They also demonstrate the diversity and innovation in Inca horticulture. The intricate water channels and fountains found in Machu Picchu are another example of Inca engineering. These systems provided a constant flow of water to the city and created sacred water sources for use in religious ceremonies. Excavations at Machu Picchu have unearthed various artifacts belonging to different handicrafts such as ceramics, stonework and metalwork. These artifacts reflect the intricacy and aesthetic sensibility of Inca art. Additionally, wall paintings and decorations depicting religious and cultural symbols, mythological figures, and scenes of daily life have been discovered. The Andes Mountains surrounding Machu Picchu still have parts that remain unexplored due to their rugged terrain and dense vegetation. Archaeologists and researchers continue to discover new structures, terraces and roads from time to time. Satellite imaging technologies and modern archaeological methods enable the discovery of these hidden areas. However, thorough mapping and examination of the interior cité require time and meticulous effort. The skeletal remains unearthed in archaeological excavations at Machu Picchu provide significant insights into the inhabitants of this ancient Inca city. Examination of the skeletons at Machu Picchu indicates that the people living here were generally well-nourished and physically active. The levels of wear and tear on the skeletons suggest that 
Heavy physical labor such as farming and construction was a significant part of life. For example, signs of arthritis in some skeletons indicate bodily wear and tear caused by strenuous work. Some specific tombs and burial rituals found at Machu Picchu reveal social hierarchy and status differences within the community. The burial of certain individuals with valuable items and adornments indicates their special status within society. The skeletal remains at Machu Picchu also shed light on Inca society's death rituals and post-mortem practices. The manner of burial, grave offerings, and selection of burial sites provide clues about beliefs and rituals regarding the afterlife. These rituals reflect the Incas' beliefs in the afterlife, the spirits of their ancestors, and supernatural powers. Initially, Machu Picchu was thought to be a city solely belonging to women. This notion stemmed from the skeletal remains discovered during Hiram Bingham and his team's 1911 discovery expedition. Bingham believed that most of these skeletons belonged to women and thus referred to Machu Picchu as a place for the virgins of the sun. This alluded to the Akla, or sun virgins, who played a significant role in Inca religious rituals and were mostly women. However, subsequent archaeological studies, particularly more advanced anthropological analyses of skeletal remains, have shown that the gender distribution of the found skeletons is more complex, including both male and female remains. Thus, the idea that Machu Picchu was solely a city for women has lost its validity in contemporary understanding. The abandonment of Machu Picchu can be explained by several factors coming together, but a definitive reason is not known. The Spanish invasion and the diseases they brought may have greatly affected the indigenous population, leading to the abandonment of this ancient city. Economic and social changes, environmental factors, and dwindling sustainable resources may also have contributed to the Incas withdrawing from this strategic settlement. However, the true reasons behind the abandonment of Machu Picchu continue to remain hidden in the depths of the Andes Mountains. This lost city of the Inca Empire sheds light on human history with its engineering achievements and natural beauty. However, the mysteries of Machu Picchu have not been fully unraveled yet. So, what untold stories lie within the depths of this ancient city? Seeking the answer to this enigmatic question may be the greatest legacy left to us by Machu Picchu. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.